hello everyone this is amit maru and today in this video we are again continue with our uh, cloud working model in that we will discuss cloud deployment model so let us start our today's video on cloud deployment model first of all let us have outline of our today's video in our today's video first we will discuss about the uh, working model of cloud then we will discuss about cloud deployment model in cloud deployment model first we will discuss about public cloud then we will discuss about private cloud then community cloud and at last we will discuss about hybrid cloud so let us first discuss our first point that is our working model of the cloud as we discuss in our previous video basically two kinds of working model of the cloud first one is a cloud service model and second one that is a cloud deployment model in our previous video we have already discuss cloud service model in detail and we discuss about infrastructure as a service then a platform as a service and software as a service this all the things we already discussed in our uh, previous video in our today's video we will continue with a cloud deployment model so we will discuss about uh, public cloud then we will discuss about private cloud community cloud and last we will discuss about a uh, hybrid cloud so let us start uh, to understand what is exactly the cloud deployment model in that first we will discuss about public cloud as the name itself suggests it is a public cloud it means that it is available for the general public so as per the definition of the public cloud we can say that the public cloud is defined as computing services offered by the third party providers over the public internet making them available to anyone who wants to use or purchase them so it is available for the local public as per the requirement of local public or user they can get service from the cloud and it is accessible for uh, everybody from anywhere the example of those companies which provides public cloud facilities are amazon and especially amazon ec2 is the best example of the public cloud microsoft is also providing public cloud and microsoft azure is the best example of the public cloud google that is a google app engine ibm also providing public cloud and this cloud services is open for use provider companies offer resources as a service both free of charge or on a pay per use basis via the internet connection so user can scale resources when required so some services are paid and some are the free so user as per the requirement can take services from the cloud if more services required user can take more services if two more or less services are required then they can scale accordingly so this is all about what is exactly the public cloud is there are some advantages and some disadvantages of the public cloud so let us discuss some advantages and disadvantages of the public cloud there are number of advantages of the public cloud among that we will discuss a few of that first advantage of public cloud is low cost in our public cloud no need to purchase hardware or software and you pay only for the service you use no maintenance the maintenance of the system is not the responsibility of end user the cloud provider is responsible for the maintenance of the hardware software and network in the cloud can be accessed from the anywhere as we discuss public cloud is available on public network so anybody can access from anywhere and last that is a high scalable as we discuss as per our requirement we can take we can purchase more services from the cloud if required more services today then we can purchase more services from the cloud if tomorrow or after few days if required less services then we can take less services from the cloud as per our requirement we can take services from the cloud so it is high scalable what is disadvantage of the public cloud the first disadvantage that is a less customizable as per our requirement we cannot modify the cloud services so we cannot customize as per our requirement 
second one is less secure because it is available on the public network or we can say public internet and anybody can access so that less security is there in our public cloud so these all are the few advantages and disadvantages we discuss there are number of advantages of the public cloud now next one is a private cloud here the private name itself says that it is a private it means that it is not for the local public in our public cloud it is available to general public while only one specific company owns a private cloud so it is also known as corporate cloud or internal cloud what is internal cloud internal cloud means that it allows the accessibility of system and services within specific boundary or organization so within the organization we can access this cloud outside the organization nobody can access the services of this private cloud so the private cloud permits only authorized user providing the organization greater control over the data and its security so any general public cannot access this services of the private cloud only employee of the uh, organization or we can say the authorized person can access all the services of the private cloud so who can go for the private cloud the business organization that have dynamic critical secured management demand based requirement should adopt private cloud just example of the private cloud is hp data center microsoft elastra private cloud and ubuntu are the example of private cloud there are certain advantages and disadvantages of the private cloud the first advantage of private cloud is highly secured as we discuss it is not for the general public it is for particular organization or a particular company so only authorized person can access all the services of the cloud so it is highly secured second one is more control private cloud have more control over their resources uh, and hardware than the public cloud improved performance private cloud offers better performance with improved speed and space capacity there are other number of advantages are there so we discuss only few advantages there are certain disadvantages of the private cloud the first disadvantage is it is costly as compared to the public cloud this private cloud provides high security more control and improved performance so definitely it will be costly as compared to the public cloud restricted area of the operation private cloud is accessible within the organization so that area of the operation is definitely limited skilled persons are required to manage and operate the cloud services so these all are the certain uh, advantages and disadvantages of the private cloud now next one is community cloud the community cloud is similar as our private cloud the only difference is the set of users in a private cloud only one company owns the server in case of a community cloud the several organization with similar backgrounds share the infrastructure and related resources here in this image you can see that more than one organization can share uh, infrastructure and related resources from the community cloud and this all the organization has a similar background now the question is who can go for the community cloud the community cloud is best for joint business organization research organization etc again the community cloud also have some advantages and disadvantages so let us discuss first advantages the first advantage of our community cloud is cost effective community cloud is a cost effective because the whole cloud is shared between the several organization as we discuss more than one organization shares resources and infrastructure so definitely it's it has a less cost as compared to private cloud flexible and scalable the community cloud is flexible and scalable because it is compatible with every user it allows the user to modify the documents as per their needs and requirement then security community cloud is more secure as compared to the public cloud but 
less secure as compared to the private cloud because multiple organization can share uh, the infrastructure and resources in our community cloud so the security is less as compared to the private but it is more as compared to the public cloud what is the disadvantage of community cloud community cloud is costly than the public cloud community cloud is not good choice for every organization the fixed amount of data storage and bandwidth is said among all community members so these will are the certain advantages and disadvantages of the community cloud now last one that is a hybrid cloud hybrid cloud is the combination of two or more cloud such as private public or community for example it is a combination of public and private cloud so it is known as hybrid cloud so what is the benefit of a hybrid cloud the benefit is non critical task such as a development and test workloads can be done using public cloud whereas the critical tasks that are sensitive such as organization data handling are done using the private cloud so we are just taking benefit of both whatever the benefit of public cloud and private cloud that we can get from the hybrid cloud so the benefit of both deployment model as well as a community model are possible in hybrid cloud hosting so this is the hybrid cloud where combination of public private or community is possible so this is all about different deployment model so we discuss about uh, public private community and hybrid model so thank you for uh, watching this video thank you thank you very much